Hey everyone, in this video we will learn how to create a date dimension based on the values in another column. So for example you are building a date dimension and the other table you have got has order date and you want to have your date dimension in such a way that the lowest value in the date dimension is the minimum value in the order date and the maximum is the maximum value in the order date. How do you build something like that? So I've got this uh, table already here with me and you can see it's got data till 31st of December 2050 which is the maximum date and if I sort it uh, ascending you can see it's giving me value from 1st of January 2000 and you can see that all I'm doing is in, I'm uh, passing the dates to the calendar function so I'm saying uh, from 1st of January 2000 to 31st of December 2050 and it builds the date dimension for me and then the rest of it is I'm just adding columns on top of that. So I'll also put leave this code in the video notes so you can you can copy the video uh, the no, the DAX code that we create now and use that to build your own date dimension. So all I'll go here is uh, let me just go to the fact internet sales table for a moment and I'll scroll to the right and I've got order date. So I'll just create a date dimension based on the minimum and maximum order date. So let's just go back here. And here with the calendar, it takes the minimum data and maximum data as values. So we will just pass min order date and I'll close the bracket out. And the maximum data I'll replace with and I'll hit enter. And if I go and look at the data values now in the calendar year function, you can see that it is showing us the value till 29th December 2010. And let's just change it to sort descending. So it's got till 28 January 2014. So the problem, there's just a slight problem with this one is that it doesn't give us the full date dimension. Um, so if you want a continuous date dimension for 2014, you won't get it because the maximum date is 2000. 28th Jan 2014 and similarly for if I sort ascending the minimum date is 29th uh, December 2010 so it doesn't have any fields before 29th December 2010 maybe you want the whole of 2010 to be there so there are a couple of disadvantages with this one which you need to be aware of so in this video we've essentially covered how to get the populate the date dimension based on values in another column in another table or it could be the same table i'll also leave the code in the video notes so you can download or play around with it i hope you find this video uh, video useful thanks for watching this video please do subscribe to my channel and like my videos if you enjoy what i'm doing cheers bye